Making a leprechaun trap is a fun and very simple activity where you can use your creativity to expand on it. The goal is to set up the simple leprechaun trap and be able to trap the leprechaun in your box. For this activity, you will need an old shoe box or any cardboard box that you have available. Mine was a bit on the flatter end, but it still worked. You will also need green acrylic paint or green construction paper, scissors, a popsicle stick, and a piece of cardstock. You will also need any sort of gold decor, paper, or stickers. If you have fake gold coins, even better. You want your trap to look pretty and appealing, so I also used an assortment of rainbow stickers. If your shoebox is not as low as mine, you may also need pipe cleaners or extra popsicle sticks to make small stairs to help the leprechaun climb onto your trap. So we are going to start by very carefully cutting a small circle close to the end of one side of your shoebox. You will most likely need parental supervision here as sometimes the cardboard can be a bit thick. This will be the trap for the leprechaun. Next, cover your box in the green construction paper or paint it and allow it to dry. Now we are going to add any decor we want to the box. To keep my trap hidden, I cut a piece of paper around the size of the hole I made and I covered it in gold star stickers as my gold. If you have fake gold, you can put that on top of your piece of paper instead, just make sure that the hole is hidden. I cut a few slits in the paper, not cutting it all the way so the leprechaun can fall in easier. I added lots of stickers to my box and any decor you would like, you may add. I glued a rectangular piece of cardstock to my popsicle stick to make a sign that says free gold. I cut a slit in the cardboard so I could stick my sign in, but you can also glue it. And we are done. I hope you enjoyed making your trap and I hope you are all successful in your activity. Thank you guys for watching. Bye!